Okay, first of all, welcome to my channel. So what we are going today is we are going to do sentiment analysis on our WhatsApp chat file that, that we had. Um, so for that, uh, because we are doing it on R Studio, so you have to install R Studio first if you don't have. And the link in the description, you can go there and install R Studio. After that, you need to open this and go here, desktop.ini. Now change it. I'll skip from there. And then you need to copy and paste this code. I have given the link of GitHub repository in the description from where you can copy and paste. Okay. The only uh, changes you need to do here is this path. Okay, this path. This one. But before that, uh, you need to uh, install four libraries which we use there uh, by going into the package, click install. And here you need to write the name, like for example, uh, word cloud, okay? And simply install because I already uh, did that. So I'm not doing that. You need to do um, install these four files similarly. Okay. Okay, fine. Now you need to uh, replace it with the path of the file on which you want to do the sentiment analysis. Okay, for that, to find the path, you, what you need to do, just go uh, where your uh, file had, like, for example, I'm going to do on this file, WhatsApp chat. Okay, just go there and copy and paste control C okay and paste it there like control v okay now um okay select all and click run after that you uh, it this uh, window will come uh, to select the file okay uh, there you need to go at the place where the file to make it easy, you can uh, paste it onto the desktop so that it will become easy to do the same. Then open it. And wait for a while. Okay. Uh, till then it is uh, running. I will tell you how can you find the WhatsApp text file. So it will be very simple for you. Just you need to go onto your WhatsApp in your phone and uh, open any inbox uh, whosoever you want to uh, get the file, chat file, okay? Just go onto the uh, inbox, any of the inbox and you can find three uh, vertical uh, points like button you had where, where when you click that, you will find a, a button say, more then click more and then here you can find export chat okay export chat and it will say without media or include media i had done this with without media you can also do with include media for but for the first time if you uh, to make it simple you can do it on without media and uh, when you click without media then it will ask for where you want to share to make it easy you can share it on gmail okay and uh, you will get the file okay uh, now you can see there the pl plot is there make it zoom and you can see like these are the uh, plots like uh, the chat in which on which i did the sentiment analysis having the positive plot highest okay highest uh, plot is the positive positive sorry and these all are the colors which will say it's anger and speciation uh, anti anticipation sorry disgust fear joy negative positive sadness surprise and trust okay so it's very simple and if you are doing a sentiment analysis on a file which is very big so it will take a little time to do the same okay so don't be get uh, frustrated Okay, so uh, for my project, I did the same on a uh, 
companies data set uh, which is amazon data set uh, if you are doing any kind of project based on this so you can uh, download the amazon data set which i give the description uh, link in the description you can simply download and do the same but uh, remember it will take a little more time to uh, show you the plot because the file is little large okay so the process is going to be the same the code is going to the going to be the same so that's it uh, if you had any query you can just uh, write into the comment okay thank you